On October 3, 1849, Baltimore journalist Joseph Walker was heading to a tavern when he noticed a man lying in a gutter. The man was in rough shape, dressed in dirty clothes, and muttering incoherently. Walker approached him and asked for his name. The man replied, My name is Edgar Allan Poe. Known as the father of horror, mystery, and detective fiction, Poe created a genre that would go on to inspire countless writers and filmmakers. Despite his fame, Poe's life was filled with hardship and misfortune, making his death as mysterious as the stories he wrote. Born in Boston in 1809 to a family of actors, Poe faced tragedy early, becoming an orphan by age two. He was taken in by John and Francis Allen, a wealthy couple from Richmond. Though he received an excellent education, his relationship with John soured, especially after Poe accrued gambling debts at the University of Virginia. His first heartbreak came when his love, Sarah Elmira Royster, became engaged to another man, fueling his desire to write. At 18, Poe moved to Boston and published Tamerlane and Other Poems, a collection that saw little success during his life, but later became a rare literary treasure. Poe went on to write The Raven, a hauntingly famous poem that cemented his place in literary history. However, despite public acclaim, he earned little money and struggled financially. His misfortune continued as he lost jobs and faced mounting debt, and in 1847, he lost his wife, Virginia. His final days remained shrouded in mystery, with theories of rabies, poisoning, and even foul play surrounding his death. Edgar Allan Poe's legacy endures as one of the most influential figures in literature. His untimely death remains an enigma, reflecting the darkness and suspense of his works.